So yeah, this is a VOD review for Barrett 50 Cal. Um, I did already have a look at this VOD. Uh, thank you for, for giving it to me. Uh, it's kind of nice, it changes the pace a little bit from like not having a video with comms. So it was really nice to, to uh, finally get a piece of video that has has communications from uh, the player. Um, yeah, I will say that um, there are sometimes there's a little bit like choppiness. Uh, but other than that, yeah, the quality was pretty decent. So yeah, much appreciated. Um, so I'm not going to watch the entire thing in this world. I feel like I'll only like bring up some really like crucial things that probably I need to say here and there. But yeah, we'll just watch the video and see how we go. So yeah, so like first off, the more mercy echo tracer rotor Hammond is. Uh, you you're basically playing a very like flank split group kind of comp right now. The mercy is gonna have a lot more of an easier time than you. Uh, to heal, uh, mainly because she has GA. Whereas your, in comparison to your form, your wraith form. Uh, I forget what it's called, Fade. You have to use it to get to, to, to positions. Normally, you don't really want to use it as like a movement ability to get somewhere because you could just do that by pressing W, usually, right? So, uh, it'd be interesting how you want to play this. I would have preferred the, uh, the Lucio, or maybe perhaps the, the Brig, because we have to control space on control maps. So, that's what I would have gone for, personally, but once uh, Moira is on point, she, she becomes really, really powerful, just because, like, she can heal in an area, and her healing orbs can, like, bounce around the map, and well, it's, it's pretty nice. The reason why I'm here is because I am confused, <coughs> and, actually not confused, just because it's for the first, first match, and uh, I need to get warm up. for pick, and it was that. Yeah, so, like... Make sure that you just warm up before a match. I don't need to tell you that. Like, yeah, we didn't need to fade there. We don't need to send out a damage orb either. Like, I, uh, it's just nitpicky. I don't personally like it. Other coaches say why not, but for alt charge, you know. Yeah, we didn't need to fade there. We weren't in threat there at all. I think you just wanted to get a different angle, maybe. Like, see, because you're playing Mora, you have to like use fade a lot to get to positions so that you can heal people. That's what I was saying before about Mercy. Mercy, she does it every two seconds, whereas you have to use something that kind of it costs you a little bit longer. Yeah, and you're gonna get charged here. Yeah, you just didn't see that. That's unfortunate. We didn't need to reset. I mean, it wasn't going to work either way, but <coughs> trying to enforce something that we probably didn't need. I'm not really, uh, what do you call it, uh, in tune with the meta right now. I've watched... The meta is anything, it's like, it's anything at lower ranks. Uh, the defined meta is probably going to be double shield at some point. Um, most likely it would be like some form of, like, a variation of spam comps, compositions. So spam indicates like people that they can can do things for free. Uh, that doesn't mean bashing though, because bashing is sta static. So you kind of want something that can like move. But yeah, it's 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 on the line of like a hybrid comp. But as long as you have two shields, that seems to be what the meta is. Normally you run the the sombra, the may, the doom, whatever that kind of shit. Like that's pretty much the meta. At least I've seen on contenders because we we're in off season for Overwatch League. So, at least from contenders and stuff, that's probably like the closest we're going to get to any kind of meta. But that's why I say it's like, it's anything, really. So, you can pretty much play whatever you want to up until Masters, I would say. Yeah, there's no there's no reason for you to follow meta. It, if it helps you, then okay. But usually you can get to high Masters GM with any hero. You just need to practice, 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 practice. Yeah. 
mechanically you just that's all you need to do to improve So because we don't have the shield, right, we have to use more resources to keep people alive because they're not using natural cover so well. So because of that, we're having to use a lot of resources of our own and also to, to get into position, we're having to use fade all, all the time, almost like it's on, you know, once it's off cooldown, that's it, you know, but it's not really this, this mercy dice here. Uh, the orb was so bad here. We didn't need it. And I, like I'm being nitpicky because of the healer that you're playing. I'm not being nitpicky at you as a player. But yeah, like the mercy's positioning there was not your fault. I don't even really think you could really say for that. I don't think you could have, to be honest with you. So that you're training right now. We didn't. We almost f faded into the stun. That you're fading. Your fading um, usage is pretty poor. I, I get why you're having to fade to heal people, but there have been a couple times where you faded and there was no need to fade. You just could just press W key. Yeah, and then Whoa. and then we press coalescence into the enemy team. That was all our fault. This game hurts my so bad. Yeah, one thing about this game, if you don't have much of, uh, you know, self-esteem, this game is not gonna really help that. I'll be honest with you. Though I'm not a psychiatrist or claim to be one. Um, uh, but you just need to, yeah, suck it up, I guess. Get better at the game. Like, that's really all it is. Because, um, Overwatch is definitely one of those, like, once you mechanically evolve as a, as a, as a player, you will start to feel more comfortable, and then your reaction to said whatever happens becomes a little bit better. But, you know, whether or not that's going to, like, give you any strain on your mental game maybe it's uh, this game is very competitive and it, it, it it's very stressful and causes a lot of like anxiety for a lot of people and yeah i don't really condone playing this game if you have any of those um so yeah definitely maybe like take intervals between playing overwatch and not so if that is something that you do definitely struggle with then maybe uh definitely seek professional help to help you with that um Playing Overwatch is not going to help you, because people. Are, this community is toxic, and yeah, the game is very, very stressful. I, I don't know. Like Mercy is so hard to pick. Ah, like uh, I mean, Mercy is okay for nearly every situation. It's just Mercy has a very like niche. She heals a very like thing that I was saying to someone earlier today is that Mercy is a very win more hero like if you're already winning Mercy just assists that win even more I mean you had to be winning in the first place Mercy is not one of those heroes that can win a fight she's more someone that can help assist the win so yeah that's something to, to keep into consideration right but yeah Let me see if I'm actually still recording, because that would be pretty shitty if I'm not. Heal, heal point, yeah, I am. Um, okay. Tracer. Right. Mercy, mercy, mercy. Not mercy, yeah. <laughs> yeah, So, like... Sombra 
Well, you play Lucio here, I can't remember what, what was going on here. So your Lucio is a little bit better than your Moira. Which is ironic. Because I've seen your VOD before. And you generally can aim. So whatever game you play, I know you say that you play Overwatch mainly. But you must play another game. Because your aiming is pretty decent for the rank that you are. I mean, you dropped a gold. So, I mean, yeah. Yeah, this is all fine. I don't really... You're playing a support Lucio right now. Your AoE healing. So you're at 54%. That's pretty decent. Considering you've just capped like 15%. Right, 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 right. Just don't jump up in the air. We should be good. Okay. Line of sight. You know what you could do here is just like, you could just speed. Like if you, if you see that your teammates are not moving out of the McCree quick enough, just speed them. You know, like you have amp for a reason. Or you could just like crossfade. Because crossfade doesn't cost you anything to use, so it doesn't it's not taxing for you, so yeah, you could just use that. 1v1ing a Reinhardt, I don't agree with, but you know, that's just me. Now we help this, we help this, we help this. Yeah, nice. We bully. As long as we have our teammates helping us. Well make sure we don't get earth shot here. Yeah. No! That's two times. That's two times, right? You did it once with the coalescence, and now you've done it with the beat. That's two times we got caught out. So, we just need to be aware that the enemy team have these ultimates, right? There's no way we would get caught out if we knew. I, I actually forgot that the Rain had uh, Earth Shadow, but I knew just by how the fight was playing out that he had it. We have to like alt track. Uh, there's a simple way to do it. If you're, if the enemy team are kind of winning the fight and the fight's uh, lasting a, a hell of a long time, because it was uh, fifteen percent when the fight started and now it's forty percent. That's a long time. That's about yeah. I want to say that's that, that was a good. Let's see, right? Because we're at nine fifteen. Let's see. Give me a second. Yeah, so from here at 9.15. That's, that's like a whole 30 seconds. Right? So a whole 30 seconds of just development over time. So in 30 seconds, a lot can happen. Like you're at 60% and in 30 seconds, you get 40%. Right? And in 30 seconds, you really believe that the Reinhardt isn't going to get any an Earth Shatter in time? So, I mean, you really need to, like, the longer the fight lasts with a Reinhardt, the more he's going to get ult charge. So, yeah, he was always going to get it pretty quickly. I mean, they even had High Noon. So, look, he's swinging, swinging. He pinned someone. Swinging, swinging, swinging. Swinging. Like here, we should just not. We should just not be here at all. Like there's no way for. There's no way we should be here. Right, and then here now, nah, like we we got away from the, from the Rhine, and then we come back. Yeah. We should be using we should be using the pillars that are around us a hell of a lot more. We could be juggling between the pillars on the map. So like kinda of what you're doing now. But you only did it for like a couple of seconds. Yeah, like what you're doing now. Just do that more. You wouldn't you wouldn't get hit with the earth shadow. I'm so pissed, man. <coughs> I'm too late on the fucking draw. Your your DM. I didn't I didn't see a DM by the way, buddy. Yeah, I know. Uh, so the majority of your teammates are over are over on the point, and you're assisting the roadhog. We also we amped poorly here. We didn't need to amp here. I I don't know why we amped here. You probably die here again. Positional. 
just not really paying attention at all. I think that's what it is. Like, right, right there, just you're not paying attention. Like, I get that you're a streamer and stuff, but it's kind of unacceptable. You should know better. If you want to improve, right? Which is what you said. You're kind of just going in, in there with, like, an AFK mentality. You should really be, like, tracking what it is that you're doing. Otherwise, why are you doing it? If you're just doing it, like, autonomously, then you know what? It's not worth doing it because you're not going to gain anything from it. You know what I mean? So let's that's, that's, that's not, that's not make a habit of this, okay? Mm -mm. Yeah, we don't want to be there. Nice. Good decision. So whenever your Hammond goes in, you should be going in with your with the rest of your team. I don't like this either because you might get earth shattered here. You like stood right in front of him. I mean, with respect, you stood in front of a Reinhardt that got you back to your spawn quicker, so. I feel like your comments are coming off a little bit too snappy, and you're frustrated with yourself because you know that you could probably be doing better, but your teammates are, I don't know, they're in the same elo as you, you know, so. I don't know, just, it's better to not have that attitude and mentality in future. I mean, you're playing somewhat AFK, you know, so you can't really say, uh, you can't really say these things when you're not really, you're not fully, you're not fully there, you know? All right, so we'll, we'll go into this fight, right? We, we follow the ball. It's just you and ball right now. Now it's you, the hog and the ball. And now your team are here. We should be assisting with speed. Lucio is really strong for speed. Right. Speed. Just speed. You're not the main healer, just speed. That's a lot of bolts. Mora behind, Mora, Mora, Mora. Kill Mora. Dude, Mora's not dead. He'll die, he'll die, Mora. Fuck, I wasn't close enough to get everyone. I don't really agree on the on the beat. No, it wasn't. You could have just line of sight. Yeah. Exactly. You 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 pretty much Like we amped here again when we didn't need to. My ult would have been great here. Exactly. Yeah. I think if I remember correctly, we lose this, don't we? We got a full regroup here. Get up here. Yeah. If I remember correctly. Need some help? Yeah, I remember we didn't get anything here. I need some help behind uh, Genji. Genji on me. Alright, this one was an interesting one as well, I remember. Like, you don't pressure this Genji whatsoever. You just heal yourself, that's not that's not applying pressure, you need to apply pressure by left clicking. Wait, what? Genji was on your Torp? I just, I thought he was in front of us. Genji's on our uh, torp now. Yeah, Genji was not on your torp. Genji is uh, with his team. Um. This is really bad. 
that you should be telling your team to back off. And the fact that you don't hear the Roadhog on the right-hand side confused me. We need to be really aware of our surroundings. And I feel like that is something you are lacking more than anything. Your mechanics are okay. It's very rare that I say this, but your, your mechanics uh, are actually okay. It's your awareness that really gets you into trouble, man. Like, really. You know? Like... If those two times you actually got your 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 ultimates off, and we had saved the the last beat, right from the earlier fight, you wouldn't have died to the grav for sure. I mean, they stopped to reaper, but they didn't have ult. So there's a lot of things like just our awareness was just a little bit more fine tuned. We would totally be winning fights a hell of a lot more easier. So like, especially when you're playing Lucio, it's it's he's got a defensive ult. That's his toolkit, right? And he speeds. You speed in to go fast. You speed in because you want to kill fast. You want to kill shit fast. You want to move to space fast. Fast, 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 fast. You don't really use Lucio for healing. You don't really... I mean, you can, like, for certain situations. But realistically, you don't ever use it for that. You use Boop for displacement. If there's anyone on high ground, there's a bunch of people on high ground. You wall ride in the safest way possible using, you know, the correct pathing to get there. You boop them off right because high ground is superiority <clears throat> and you beat whatever whatever the fuck you're countering so grabs earth shatters emps all that good stuff right fluxes so you really need to be like this is what i'm gonna save beat for you know and you just i don't know you just you're not really with the team but you're still with the team and then you come out in the open and then you you drop the beat and it will save your team you win fights just by that just by doing that right but it's just Remembering what it is that we, we're keeping beat for is really like what makes the difference between a Lucio player that just plays Lucio casu casually and a Lucio player that plays him because they want to improve and they know what they're doing, you know? So, uh, with Baptiste in mind, we use Lamp to save from uh, big uh, uh, ultimates and cooldowns, like huge ones. We want to save our team. But we need to understand that maybe we're saving it for a certain ability or, 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 or ultimate. Because if you use your lamp now, and by lamp I mean the immortality field, let's call it lamp. Um, if you use it because you're receiving pressure from a said flanker, like, well, yeah, it stops you from dying, but now you don't have it for another 25 seconds, right? So, or 30 seconds. So, like, in those 30 seconds, as we saw in the previous uh, map, 30 seconds can really, like, change the dynamic of the of the fight. And it will either be in your favor or not. So, it really does make a big difference. 30 seconds is a huge difference. Anything can happen. <laughs> so, we should be really using, especially, like, big cooldowns, like, like uh, Immortality Field. We should be really, like, questioning, why are we using it? Do I need it for, like, Riptar? Do I need it for Grav? Do I need it for Urshan? Do I need it for X, Y, Z? Blah, 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 blah. You know? Think before you do them. Think before you use the abilities. That's all I'm saying. That Genji should have just, you know, fucked off if we put, like, enough left clicks into him. Honestly. Like, your aim is capable of doing so, so why didn't you? You were scared that you were going to lose your tanks. They can shield. Ask your teammates to actually help you. You know? So. Yeah, if we had known that the Roadhog was was around the corner we could have uh, uh used our um, rocket boots to get up he wouldn't have hooked us here oh uh, roadhog on me yeah this wouldn't have happened yeah. this would not have back happened up, back up wait for people you can still touch like not, not mainly you can still contest this I mean, you got one pick, so still contestable. But now it's not. <clears throat> so there's like windows where you shouldn't, when you shouldn't, you know, contest. You were, they were one down, and you were two down. But you had window. Window is uh, the amp matrix. Right? And because it got buffed, everyone can shoot through it. And I mean, that thing is so nice to just damage with even you on your own 
let alone a Torb turret and the Torb himself, let alone a right click from the from the Zarya. Man, if you like can just contest there and you have like your immortality field too. You know what I mean? Like if you don't use any ultimates but you only use yours. I reckon they're gonna they're gonna maybe use a lot more ultimates that way just to contest. Who knows? So <clears throat> it was kind of the good plan, in my opinion, at least just to use uh Baptiste that way. Just to just to hold out on point. That's what I would have done. It's a bit unfortunate. Also, don't be in front of shield. No, hog, hog left side. Watch it. Watch it. Ryan behind. Use your boots. You don't use your boots. I remember you don't use your boots often. Hog no hook. Yeah, we could have healed him. We could have healed the drunk rat. Use your boots. Use your boots. Use your boots. Use your boots. Use your boots whenever you're playing. Don't be frontlining. Mm, we didn't need to use that either. So we're not thinking about it. Yeah, we have to play safe now because you don't have it. I mean, we could be using natural cover, but I mean, we didn't really need to use it there. It wasn't, there wasn't anything. There wasn't anything that was really gonna kill us, right? I don't have immortality for that. Nice, huge. You got saved by your team here. need to pop the that, but. No, no. I mean, the drunk rat really should have killed you there, but you didn't. You didn't use immortality field because of the drunk rat. You used it because you were pushing aggressively, and the Zarya was there. So, uh, torp, torp, torp. Come here, come here, come whilst it it kind of paid off. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna happen all the time. Yeah, that's a bit unfortunate. That's just people not respecting the hog. That's all. I don't know what the spire is doing. But she's a lost cause right now. Respect the hog. We're using we're using lamp uh, to excuse our bad aim for healing. So work on your right click. Baptiste does two things. He shoots on left mouse and heals on right mouse. So however it is that you, you set your keybinds but he does two things and he can do them kind of at the same time he has to do one after the other but he can kind of do both at the same time right so you need to practice that as well your awareness you need to practice on every single hero you just need to be more aware you need to calculate everything that's happening in front of you why are we using this cooldown is it something that we're saving it for can we use it again to save something else right like if we use it now can we use it again or will it be too late? Rocket boots. It doesn't cost me anything. So I may as well just use the high ground so that people can't get to me. Simple. You know? Increase our awareness. It's a little bit better. Oh, hog, hog, yeah. Hog behind you, right hard. Yeah, we didn't die there. I'm we could use lamp. Just... Same thing again. I'm not going to repeat myself. It's just the same thing again. Yeah, I mean, we could have used the lamp to save the nice. the Rhine. Also, we're not respecting this hog, which is what you should be doing. Yeah, this window was really, I don't know what, what it was. You got one kill, which is great. It's good enough. So, like, Mercy's you do low, one, you do low. one good thing. And then you do one bad thing. 
This is good. Putting pressure is good. See how much pressure you're making? It's a shame that you were doing it all in the wrong time, though. Like, your team were already dead, but you were doing it. You were doing stuff, which is kind of cool. What do we play here? Moira, right? I feel like it's going to be the same. Yeah, I remember it was the exact same problem as before on uh, on the control map. Use fade way too like uh, free. It's like your ability to get out. Man, you nearly died there. I guess a little bit better. Remember that Mori has a heal over time, so you didn't really need to use that much juice on her, but I like that you did anyway, just like to presume that something was gonna happen to her. That was a, that was the first time you actually used your brain to think like maybe there's something that's gonna happen if the mercy res. That was the first time you did it. So yeah. Well played. Nice, nice. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay, so the gauge is really important. You want to always keep above the 50% threshold because, like, you, there will be moments where you really, really need to heal. And if you if you can't, like, use your, your healing orb, then, like, you have to use, like, your main resource, which is your left click, to heal, right? And if you don't have Coalescence, then, yeah, you're going to run out of healing resources really quickly. So it's awesome that you're keeping tabs on that resource. It's so important. Good stuff. So why are we using coal here? Think. Why? Yeah, we probably could have used coal here to like help catch up with the heals. Now we're low on resources. We're just all over the place, positionally speaking. They're just memeing on us at this point. Yeah. Then they know they can. I really do hate gold. <laughs> Most location. Good call. This was pr probably like... <laughs> a r this is the kind of call I like to see. Yeah, let's see, like, it's unfortunate that there was a fire up in the sky killing your, your, well, I mean, they only killed, like, one, one person. But yeah, your coal, your coal usage was pretty good. I had nothing to say about your coal here. It was just more, like, how you use your, your wraith form more than anything, or, sorry, your fade. It's so bad. You just, okay, when you use fade as more, think of it as the only ability you can use to get out of a really bad position that you're in right you're, you're you're in you've been pressing w for way too long and now you're in front of the team whoops never mind i just use fade you see what i mean don't use it to play aggressively don't use it to just move a little bit to the left or to the little or a little bit to the right you don't need to use that you can just move yourself with good positioning you'll get better and that way you won't even have to use fade right like, if anything, you'll probably use Fade to get onto other high grounds and just use the Fade manipulation thing. It's like, there's like a whole YouTube about how to do it. You can get onto like certain places of the map if you're using Fade, like Fade jumping. And like, I've seen people do some crazy shit with that. But your coal usage? Pretty damn nice. Yeah. Um, there wasn't much I really wanted to go over on here because you Let's played, you played, uh, I think, yeah, this is King's Row, right? Not King's Row, Hollywood. Oh no, this is Hanamura. I don't know why I thought you played Hollywood. Awareness. 
you just have to like pan left and right dude i'm gonna be real with you awareness is your big fault at here right you know like right now it's, it's the main reason why you're you're kind of decaying in rank you're just not really you're not really looking around you're not really like seeing targets that can be killed you're not really as like when you're playing looser you're not really assisting your team with speed when you're using your ultimates bar the moira uh you're not really using it to help we're not using it to counter anything yeah we're using cooldowns to save ourselves because our healing is bad so we really need to think about what it is that we're doing i've said it already see like here instead of just making our reinhardt spam uh shield right because that's all he's doing he's spamming his shield we just speed him in like we have six people right now we don't but when we have six people we just okay i'm gonna speed everyone in, in three one two three speed everyone in it's a it's so it's a broken ability and we can use it to really like make the space uh we can get into the space way quicker all of this is just not doing anything all we're doing right now is we're funneling uh, support ultimates that's all we're doing yeah it's the same thing over and over again pretty much i remember your teammates wanted you to take the right go up the right hand side but we didn't i think if i remember It was so unfortunate you got out, but it was so unfortunate. Yeah, nice, nice aiming with Lucio. See what I mean? Like <clears throat> your mechanics are okay, but it's your healing. It's I don't know. Your healing is. Mercy, 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 mercy. You need to practice. Hmm. Mercy, mercy, mercy. Yeah, I don't really have anything else to say. I think he plays Zen, right? I don't think you... No, you don't play Zen. This is Moira, Lucio, Temple of Anubis. It's the same... It's the same... It's the same thing. Yeah, it's the same thing, I remember. And then you get tilted after this game. Okay, I'm going to write down a couple of things that I want you to work on, um, but it, honestly, it's mainly your awareness um, that's really, like, not helping you here, okay? So, I've I've watched, like, I've watched this twice now, and, yeah, there was, it, there was no point in me watching it again with you. Um, it's always the same issues, always every single time doesn't matter what map we play doesn't matter what hero we play it's always the same thing your awareness is just not you need to work on it basically uh so yeah anyway i hope this helps um if you have any questions you know where to find me just dm me and i'll get back to you as soon as i can okay uh but yeah i'm gonna write down in 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 the discord messages and i'm gonna give you like a couple of things that you need to work on okay anyway thank you this has been barrett 50 cal on support uh yeah thank you so much